Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Nadine here. And me, Hayden. And Hayden would like to do another review for a book that he's just read. And he read this one so fast that I didn't even get to read a page with him. Yeah. So I don't know what it's about either. So what have you, what have um, you read? It's called The Fox and the Ghost King. Mm -hmm. It's made by Michael Mapolgo. Yeah. Um, and illustrated by Michael Foreman. This is the picture. Excellent. So, what was that about then? Um, it was about foxes, and once they came home mm -hmm. from a sad day right. at um from a football pitch, and the team they liked the most um lost, and um, and so far they've always lost, and um they heard a voice, and that was at. Only um Richard the Third um, calling for help from under the ground, and he was waiting for the archaeologists um to find him. Oh. Wow! And um they and the foxes heard it, and they started digging him digging him out. And he's made a king's promise, and right. um, that every match, um, that um, Leicester City, that was what Leicester it was. Leicester City. Leicester City, um, and um, every match that they play, um, they would win. Wow, that's not the ending, is it? No. God, because we don't want to tell people the ending, do we? No, definitely not. Okay. But let me take oh. what the ending. So you really enjoyed it then, did you? Yeah, and there's loads of other books. What, by, by the same author? Yep. Oh, fantastic. So lots to keep an eye out for then. Because you're reading like crazy at the moment, aren't you? Yeah. Um, they're called Outlaw Alone on a Wild Wild. Wild Wide Sea, Shadow, Private Peaceful, Running Wild, so, Amazing Story of Adolphus Tips, Sparrow, The True Story of Joan on, of Art, mm -hmm. and then the last one is Listen to the Moon. Awesome. So what was so good about this book then that had you reading it so fast? <laughs> The bit I liked the most was... Was it really well written? Yeah. Oh, and this is what the writing looks like inside it. Oh, okay. Wait, let me just get a bit closer, because they can't really see, would they? No. There. Cool. Cool, so... And there is... Um, if you count all of them, there would be... 142 pages, 143. 144. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, were the characters really interesting then? Mm -hmm. And you were telling me... Um, something about Shakespeare in there as well, weren't you? Yeah. So you um, Let me a, just you see a, where the picture is. You learnt a few bits from it as well, didn't you? Because you quoted Shakespeare to me this evening when we were talking about it. So I always think that's really good, isn't it, when you've got a story and you can learn little bits as well. I think I remember what it said. Mm -hmm. Oh, my kingdom for a horse. Yes. Wait, I think I just saw it and gone past it. No, I didn't. Was there anything about the book you didn't enjoy? Mm, I don't think so. Wow. So, if you had to give it a score out of 10, what would you give it? 10. 10. Wow. Oh. So, we definitely Here's need... Here's a bit that I think might be from Shakespeare. Mm -hmm. They buried him with all the pomp and honour and dignity he had so long before. Is that I don't from know. Shakespeare? I don't know. But it says that um, like... Like it's a quote, doesn't it? Actually, I think this is the bit 
Look, they were watching at the and park. There's some lovely illustrations in there. See there. Yeah. Excellent. Well, thank you very much for sharing that. And so 10 out of 10, I think that is a definite Hayden recommendation right there. Mm -hmm. So thank you very much for joining us. And I'm sure this will be a regular feature on our channel, won't it? Yes. Excellent. Well, thank you very much, guys. And we'll chat soon. Bye.